payments page like this uh, if you have been looking for a way to create an account on flutter wave in this video i'm going to show you how to create an account on floral wave and how to actually set up a page that looks like this uh, so floral wave is an online payment uh, fintech company that can help you accept payments from your customer probably you have an online store or a, a website where you sell things to your customer and you want to integrate a page like this where your customer can pay with card or with ussd pay with bank transfer and other options available so in this video i'm going to show you how to create an account with floral wave step by step all right if you're new to this channel click on the subscribe button below also uh, turn on the notification bar so that whenever i release amazing content like this you'll be the first to know all right let's get right into it how to create a floral wave account all right the first thing you do is to go to the sign up page here yeah, something like this i'll leave the link to the page in the description below all right you put your name so your first name you put your first name first let's use uh software allow okay your trading name will be your business name something like this you can see on this page uh, i showed you here you can see it shows amw group you can actually change this later you can put something else here so that your customer will know it's you so let's put uh this okay let me actually pull this tab here all right software allow let's put um let's put pitch let's use uh, pitch hq hq all right okay email address let's use this email address i have here page hq email gmail one so if you have your business email address you can use it so you can select your country probably nigeria ghana mozambique so but i'll choose it i'll choose nigeria for this case how do you hear about your just choose social media because uh youtube is a social media platform so if you ask you for referral code Referral code just use a uh, RV H29469. Then move on to the password. The password should be uh, eight characters that are uh, eight digits. Okay, let's use a uh, okay, let's use uh, something. You have to use uh, uppercase letter, lowercase letter, a number, and a special character, and everything must be eight. So let's use something very simple. Okay, let's use pitch HQ. Okay, pitch HQ. Let's just put one, two, three, four. But don't use uh don't use something as that's too simple for people to guess. Password is very very important. Then you click on guest diary. Okay, guest diary. So you can see that it's loading here. It's loading. You can see it's loading. So you see we've sent an email to you with a link to confirm your account. So let me check my email here. So you, you log into your email. So you can see email verification just in time. So let's see that. So you, you just click on the confirm email address here. Click on the confirm email address. You can actually do this on your mobile phone. So but I find it very easy for me to, to operate on the uh, system. That's why I'm doing this. To accept payment as an individual. So if you have to accept payment as a registered business. So if, if your business is not yet registered, I will advise that you choose this option. Welcome. So let's make sure you have just the right tools to your to grow your business. So if you are a freelancer or you don't your your business is yet to be registered, just go with this. Or probably you can't find your certificate again, just like me. <laughs> All right. So to accept payments as a registered business, you can choose this. To accept payments as an NGO, so let's let's go with this. So continue to dashboard. Please hold while you create your account so it's creating the account in the background all right if you are yet to subscribe to this channel click on the subscribe button below also turn on the notification bar you can see our dashboard is ready you can see you are live just like that we have created a floral wave account and we can start receiving payments from customers but we need to set up some things so let's add some details here phone number let me put uh let me put one of my phone number okay so one time password has been sent to the phone number okay they will send you uh, an otp code let's go find the otp let's go find it okay give me give me some time here let me find it on my phone so you you, you just put the otp code sent to you all right let's use this one two six five three six five three six so just submit the code so submit that 
and if you don't receive it just click on resend otp so that's it put your bank details um let's use one of my bank accounts here let's use assets bank uh, we'll use, let's use shell's first bank okay let me use my first bank account so you have to put your account details first bank okay uh your account number so this is just this is in case so that when they want to settle you because they will credit any amount your customer pay you uh floral wave will actually credit it to your account so you put your bvn uh why need your bvn so i'm going to pause the video put my bvn and then we can proceed okay um okay let me pause the video and put my bvn so after putting your bvn you come here so you see I've already put my BVN is right successful. So that's bank details. I've added bank details. So the next thing is to put your merchant's information. So what's your trading name or trading name, registration business name? So that's that's what we put. Let's leave it like that. So what does your business do? Let's say uh, um uh okay, what can we put? Uh online online sorry, online store. Sorry online store so you can just put online store describe please describe your business in a minimum of three words online store okay okay let's just put baby online store you just put anything there you just put baby online store i'll just describe what your business is all about it doesn't have to be something complicated uh, your residential address let me put uh um don't let us use a real address yet but for you you use a real okay let me use my address current address so you choose just put everything everything is for kyc purposes uh, due to cbn uh, compliance your industry so let's put uh, e-commerce let's see if we can find e-commerce the money transfer mm, let's come true bank and non so don't choose okay just choose something okay let's see education payment service provider you can choose others if you can't find yours submit compliance so let's just submit that compliance information submitted successfully so after doing that basically your account is set and you are ready to accept payment from your customers so the first thing you need to do to after setting everything up here is to create a payment link something like this where your customer can pay you something like this so you don't you don't have to be tech savvy to create something like this and i'm going to show you how we can do it now just uh sorry not here so i think the link is here let's put it back okay you just click on this you can see here uh, yeah so eight links so just click on that you can see create payment link we are actually going to create a payment link and the fantastic thing about flora wave is that you can create payment link uh for subscription a single payment link that is where your customer can just pay you once and leave or the a subscription that is maybe you have a product that they need to pay for every month and you need to collect payments from them so you can create that then you can create a donation page if you're an ngo where people can donate to a cost so and you don't need to have any program or even create a website for all this you can just share these links okay all right let's create a single ch charge that is the customer will pay once so payment link name the payment link name will be something like this that is this amw group you put your own name the name that's the name of the customer we see on the page all right let's use um let's use okay let's use okay let's use uh, baby pampas so let's assume you want to sell to baby pampas in this case so let's say the pay, the baby's pampas is uh uh five thousand six thousand naira. so or you can leave it uh, empty if you want the customers to select the amount they want to pay but in this case let's use 6005 6005 don't do the mistake so you make sure the you check the the decimal points here so that you won't type 650 instead of 6500 all right description kindly pay for the goods here thank you for your for your patronage all right you can put anything here anything you want your customers to see see more show more options you can show more options 
so use the custom url so you can put flutterwave.com uh if you that if you look at this look at this here you can see that there are a lot of things here a lot of numbers so but if you want it to be customized you can just put baby palm pad baby palm pad you can just put your name so that just to differentiate it let's use uh pitch hq okay okay let's use pitch pitch h okay let's use ph so that because others might also be using might also be shortening their links so that it won't you, your link will not be redirected to their own so just use your own website name pitch hq baby pampas so just to differentiate yourself redirect after payment so where so this is where you want them to like this is uh, the website they will go like after making payment here maybe the person pays here the next page it will pay that's what you will get okay you can just send them to a sign up page or any other page or you can leave everything here you can it's not necessary you you fill all the details there you can just uh, minimize it here and just click on create link that's it so as you can see as fast as simple as that we just created our link so you can see 6500 so you can view link you can view link you can see the name we put there php baby pump past so that's it so the customer will need to fill their name their last name their email address so you can see the 6500 6, naira we put is still here they click on pay and all these things are hosted on flora wave website so you don't need to create any website and if you have your website that's fine so you just need to put the link to your payment uh that is this link here you just need to copy link just click on copy link and go and put it on your website so it will direct them to this page for them to pay so after that the customer will just put it put their details here pay with ussd they can pay with ussd if they want they select their bank so you can pay with bank you can pay with transfer for those that don't want uh to leave their card details so which is very very fantastic for uh for merchants or for freelancers uh that want to accept payments so that's how to create your flora wave account step by step i hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed this video give this video a thumbs up also subscribe to this channel also if you have any question i will be in the comment bar below so just leave it in the comment section and i will be willing to help all right thank you very much and i'll see you in the next video